Keen here, Boxer Bands here in the Devonish Celtic Clash 10. I'm here with uh, essentially not newly turned over now, Caitlin, like, but uh, what your third fight now, your third pro fight, yeah. your first one in six months, obviously, since um, down in Cork. Um, how did you feel tonight getting back out? It felt absolutely amazing just to get back into the ring and just feeling of the light gloves again. It just felt really, really good. felt like I was back home. So yeah. It was unreal. Yeah. Um, your opponent, uh, what do you think of her tonight? She was very, very durable. I, I got through some big, heavy shots there, which if any of my sparring partners, I would have probably dropped them. So she's good. She's durable. She was hitting hard. And it was especially, it was a good one to get in against. Like, she's box unreal fighters, the likes of Terry Harper, Sherelle Brown, all them big names. And just goes to show where I actually am. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. it's good. Um, so, obviously, you had a bit of time out, uh, probably about six months or so, like a lot of Irish fighters at the moment. Yeah. Um, what have you been doing? Who have you been sparring? You've been sparring Siobhan, and um, what have you been working on to improve? So, I've been sparring Siobhan, I've been sparring uh, Sinead Kavanagh and Grania Welch, which three very different fighters. Swan likes to be up tall and long, and deers are very, like, in short range. So, I've been working on... Like I know I'm a good fighter, so I've just been working on like tweaking little things to improve myself. And I've been working alongside Niall Barrett in Unit Three, and ever since I joined up with him, it's just it's been a major, major improvement. So a lot of point breaks. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, now you're moving into the new year. Uh, what what are you looking to, do, to where are you looking to be at by the end of the year? Like uh, people tell me where they want to be in a ranking, uh, how many rounds they want to be fighting. Uh, what do you do? You look at Siobhan like. You know, in the women's side of boxing, you can move very quickly because not a lot of depth in it. So Siobhan literally was fighting for a belt in our whatever fourth fight or third fight. So what do you want to position you want to be in? So <laughs> Stephen keeps giving out to me every time I say this, but I'd like to get as many fights as I, as I can in by the end of the year and hopefully get a like a title by the end of the year and just keep working, working on my record, get at least to maybe 6-0, 8-0 by the end of the year, even more. So I just love to fight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just keep me in the ring and that's how I'm happy. So Look, a title fight is very possible. Once you have a dance partner in the women's, uh, it can just happen like that overnight. Mm -hmm. It's just getting the dance partner and, and sorting out logistics, really. Yeah. Um, is there anyone on your radar at all that you know, know of? At the moment, like there's a few out there that would be great to fight and like it happens very, very quick in the women's game. It's like you have the likes of Terry Harper that is world champion by her ninth fight. You have all these females that it's just very quick so you have to just stay ready. We're not really looking at anyone at the moment. Like there's obviously a few girls we'd like to fight, but we uh, we'll keep that in at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well uh, Caitlin, I'll let you enjoy your night and really appreciate your time, okay? Thank Thanks you very, very much. much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.